The construction industry really hasn't embraced digital transformation. 30% of the waste in our landfills comes directly from the construction and job sites. And this is where prefabrication and the digital tools that we're using now can help reduce that waste. Construction has still relied on its manual processes that it's been using for millennia, really. Post and beam style construction on site. That's still what we're doing today to a large extent. When mass production was really, you know, developed and invented by Ford, it was, you know, trying to standardize the entire manufacturing process so you can maximize the throughput, have great efficiency, and minimize waste. There's actually been a 200% increase in uh, the productivities and efficiencies of that sector over the last 50 years. In the last 25 years, the construction sector has stagnated or declined in its productivity. One aspect of that is people are walking around with materials up to 40% of the time that they're on a construction site. And so prefabrication, when you have the materials where you need them at the time you need them, that alone uh, may be 40% more efficient uh, than on-site construction. So it's time to bring technological revolution to the construction industry. Uh, and Branch is beginning to do that because we're combining prefabrication and uh, digital fabrications. So for Branch, direct digital manufacturing starts with a digital model. So we have digital models that come from clients, from partners, architects, developers. So we often begin with the digital model as a platform for building out a project. So you're not dealing with um, back and forth manual iterations of shop drawings and approvals and submittals where things can get lost in translation and you're literally looking at a piece of paper and trying to scale that to a fabrication process. Instead, it all lives in this digital environment. It's trackable, it's precise, and can be translated through to the end product directly. One of the things that we're bringing to the table is design freedom. When the 3D model is both the source of what you want the building to look like and it's the source for digital fabrication, then what you see is what you get. That is a huge aspect of digitalization and the promise of what it brings to the construction industry is endless customization and knowing that that possibility can become real. Many of our clients want to have kind of a signature building, just trying to make that building out of off-the-shelf standardized components becomes really difficult. And that's why you see so many buildings that are just, you know, almost identical. For us, the distinction between mass production and mass customization is a really important one. I think that the model of mass production is really a 20th century model for manufacturing. And it's all about efficiency and repeated unitization. What we're trying to do is sort of leverage the best characteristics of a mass production mindset, where you use standardization to increase your capability to scale your product. What's beautiful about mass customization is that if it's done well, you get this distinction between your various units while maintaining a level of efficiency that rivals a mass production model. Another problem that digitization and prefabrication will solve is the growing labor gap. There's a generation of people that are retiring in the next 10 to 15 years. So how do we bring new blood uh, into an, a very old industry where there's not a lot of interest in uh, younger generations to come into the construction industry? It's the marriage of a person right alongside a robot and it's collaboratively working together. The robot is doing the the dangerous, the repetitive, the boring aspects. Uh, the person is using their intelligence and their creativity uh, and their eye for quality to say that is good or it's not good. That by adopting these new technologies, you'll be able to attract new people to the workforce. You're gonna be able to do more work with less people while also providing jobs that have generally higher quality of life. And so what's great about Branch is that we are in the construction industry and all the young talent that we have working with the robotics in CAD in production, they are a part of the future construction industry. They don't really know it yet, but they are. And we're doing that through our digital prefabrication process.